Educating you on randomly selected medical topics until you become a doctor. Part 10. I don't understand these renal tubular defects. Like, what is Fanconi syndrome? You should ask the nephrologist. Okay, where am I going to find a nephrologist? I don't know, just summon one. You summon one. Hey, I've given up learning the kidney. You're the one still trying. Fine. I chant this rhyme, O Lord of P, come forth and share thy salt with me. O loop of Henley, swift and slick, appear, O Doc, and make it quick. <gasps> it worked. Andy's got a whiteboard. What have I done? Fanconi syndrome is simply a reabsorption defect in the proximal convoluted tubule. Here you end up excreting all the things that this part of the nephron reabsorbs. Oh, like bicarb? And phosphate, potassium, and a whole lot of water. How do you get Fanconi syndrome? Lots of ways, from inherited diseases like cystinosis. Oh, what is that? We'll save that for a second summoning. Oh, oh, okay, sorry, sir. You can also acquire Fanconi syndrome later in life from medication side effects, multiple myeloma, lead poisoning. What happens to the patient? They get volume depleted. Kids have growth restriction. Poor phosphate reabsorption leads to weak bones. I was summoned, bro. Not now, ortho. Oh, salt, bro. This is great. You think I could summon a cardiologist to teach me how to read EKGs? Dude, no.